it's rough this time of the year for us allergy sufferers. We've got some sneezing going on back in the weather center here. We've got the birch, maple, and oak right now that are the predominant pollens. Everything kind of blossoming and blooming here. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, so the next several days going to be on the high levels. It knocks down a bit on Saturday, and that's because we do have some rain moving in. For the start of the weekend, we'll talk more about that in a second. 50 degrees in Boston right now, lower 50s in Lawrence. We're in the 40s from Taunton back down to Falmouth and Chatham at 49 degrees right now. Some 40s inland as well. North Adams at 43, Keene's at 42 degrees, 46 in Springfield. And there's some fog just like yesterday. The visibility has now dropped in Portsmouth. So I do think some of this fog may try to come south and kind of back up into eastern Massachusetts here. Depends on where you are, though, of course. Fog lights on south shore, south coast, back down through Bristol County, Cape and Island. Other than that, a very similar day once the fog burns off which will take until about mid to late morning, lifts to a layer of low clouds. Otherwise, we're kind of wedged in between a storm out to sea, a front back to the west. Both of these will impact us in kind of different ways over the next couple of days. So today is fine. The sun breaks out. will be in the 70s inland, another beautiful day, 60s at the coast. Tonight, as that storm center makes its closest pass to New England, we may get some clouds, some showers that develop overnight tonight into pre-dawn tomorrow on Cape Cod. Other than that, we're dry overnight tonight, and our Thursday actually looks good. Sun and clouds, even by 5 p.m., any showers will still be off in eastern New York and far western New England. These will swing through. They'll kind of lose a little bit of steam, so it's a quick shower tomorrow night. The front is pushing offshore on Friday. The wind shifts around behind it out of the northwest, brings in drier air again. Friday looks like a beautiful day, but will be cooler kind of overall, running in the 60s for highs. Still very pleasant to end the week. And then later on Friday night, you notice clouds back to the west and some showers. This is a warm front that's going to be approaching, but it looks like we may stay on the cooler side of the front this weekend. And that will mean some periods of clouds and showers, especially on Saturday and perhaps into the first part of Mother's Day, especially along the south coast. Highs today, 60s at the coast, around 70 in Plymouth away from the shoreline, 60 to 65 in the Cape, mid-50s Nantucket, and we bump it up a little bit inland. Fantastic warm day, 78 in Fitchburg, lower to middle 70s for many of us. Fog and clouds fill back in at the coast tonight. There'll be some showers on the Cape, overnight lows in the 40s. Highs tomorrow, 65 to 70 at the coast, a beautiful day. Mid-70s again through the interior. Our fantastic spring stretch continues on Friday, although we will be cooler, but still, 60s this time of the year, really pleasant. And we cool it off a bit to start the weekend. On Saturday, we should be in the low 60s with some showers likely. Sunday for Mother's Day, there may be some wet weather in the morning, especially along the south coast if that front kind of gets hung up. And then we should start our warm-up for the start of next week. 70s by Monday should be pushing 80 by Tuesday.